Vladimir Putin called blast on Crimea Russian bridge an act of terror. Vladimir Putin has blamed Ukraine directly for the blast at a vital bridge linking Russia and Crimea, describing the weekend attack as act of terror carried out by Ukrainian secret services amid growing expectation that the Kremlin plan and intimates and harsh escalations of its war. There's no doubt this is an act of terrorism aimed at destroying critically important civilian infrastructure, the Russian president said in a video release on Sunday night on the Kremlin Telegram channel about the explosion on Kerch Bridge, which occurred on Saturday. This was device carry out an order by the Ukrainian special services. Putin spoke after meeting Alexander Baryshkin, the head of Russia's investigative committee, who was presenting finding into explosions and fire on the bridge. Baryshkin said he had opened a criminal case into an act of terrorism, adding, "We have already established the route of the truck, which he said include transit through Bulgaria." Georgia, Armenia, North Ossetia, Casanorda. His remarks set the scene for an expected response by Moscow, with Putin convening his National Security Council on Monday to discuss the blast as it hit the structure linking Russian occupied Crimea to the Russian mainland. The blast on the bridge over the Kerch Strait, a key supply route for Moscow's force in southern Ukraine, had prompted lethal messages from Ukrainian officials on Saturday, but no claim of responsibility. The bridge is also a major alternative for the port of Sevastopol, where the Russian Black Sea fleet is based. The attack was a humiliating blow to Putin's prestige, who personally opened the road section of the 12-mile bridge in 2018 and backed the $4 billion construction. The bridge was viewed by Ukrainian as a hated symbol of Russia's aggressively expanded ambition. Putin's remark came a day after the attack and the promotions hour after hardline General Sergei Sukhokin as the first overall commander of Russian force in Ukraine. After increasingly public criticisms of Moscow's mounting military failures in recent weeks, separately Russian FSB security service claimed on Sunday it has seen a considerable increase of Ukraine fire into its territory in recent days. Since the start of October, the number of attacks from Ukrainian armed formations on Russia's border territory was considerably increased, said the FSB, which is responsible for border security. Meanwhile, the latest violence, at least 12 people were killed by Russian shellings of a residential area in Ukraine's southeastern country of Zaporizhia, a region of Kremlin illegal claim to have annexed despite not controlling all of it. As Russia has tried to downplay the significance of the bridge attack, some nationalist bloggers have begun to revive criticisms at Putin for failing to address the bridge attack. The Washington-based Institute for the Study of War noted. That's all for today. Thank you and goodbye.